thank you. Yeah, you got some mm-hmm. cool ones. I got some new stuff done. Thank you to my friend Grace who came over here to the house. Oh, love cool it. Stuff. And then look at the little The little wings, wings are so cute. <laughs> so I'm obsessed. my dad and my mom, my guardian angels that look out over Love that. That's very sweet. Yeah. Isn't that wonderful? Yes. And then on my penis, it says James Bartolet. Right now it just says James. But when I'm hard, it goes Bartolet. <laughs> Bartolet. I believe it is well as hard like to keep hard during the tattoo on your dick, yeah. yeah. Um, now you don't have to, you don't want tattoos. No, I, I have a few, but sh- I'm kind of done because like my my style and like all mm-hmm. the things like do not require as much. Like I remember like ten years ago, I wanted to do whole sleeve, yeah. whole back. Thanks God, I didn't have money that time. <laughs> <laughs> You know, that's something that, that, that Grace and I had talked about. People should really think about tattoos mm-hmm. before they get them. Now, Tori, you mm-hmm. don't have any either. Not a one. It's well, like, well. if I'm either going to have nothing or I'm going to be covered. Yeah. Right. And just like full send it. You know, it's either my so personality this is your or your decision not. or your <laughs> team's decision? Well, I started like when I was 19 and I didn't really have anything I wanted that bad. Yeah. And then I was like, well, if I'm going to do it, like, it's, you gotta have a hardcore. Now, Come it started on. means and this is when yeah. you made your transition. Oh, started means in the industry. Oh, okay. Transition a very long time ago. Teens. Oh, you did? Yeah. Did you really? Teens. God bless you. Wow, yes. yes. Well, you know, Crystal Penn and Fox, you, you recently worked with mm-hmm. on the scene. Yeah. Um, they had the queer prom over there mm-hmm. at the Avalon, and it was all benefiting LGBTQ yes. teens. And mm-hmm. it's so important out there mm-hmm. to have that support yeah. that you probably didn't have when you were young, did you? I see I was very lucky and I did have a decent amount of support for especially at that time and at that age yeah. um, to have the backbone that I did with my family um, but I think cure prom is like s- such a beautiful idea too because most of those girls did not get a prom and if they no. did they probably had a brick thrown at them on the way in mm-hmm. <laughs> and so I think it's just a very cute idea to be like let's do it all over again and I think it's a very worthy cause mm-hmm. too because yeah. the mental health thing is important mm-hmm. but we need mental health in our industry too Mont- right? yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, mental health right. common sense it's always we're liking about mm-hmm. yeah. and we see a lot of these girls and they're getting into mischief and they're you know, drinking or mm-hmm. doing the drugs yeah. and, or they're getting the suitcase pimp boyfriend that's yeah. like yeah. Which know. also so Crystal sad. Penn from yeah. and the whole Green Bay team is now working on pineapple support, which is mental health. Yes, it is. Um, Good point. For yeah. the industry. Yeah. And so it's kind of the first of its kind. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And it's very exciting to see what they can do with that. And yeah. it, it's important that we have this, whether it's adult or mainstream, it's important to have mental health support for actors, mm-hmm. for actresses. Because this is a very stressful business. It mm-hmm. really is. And people yeah. are going crazy right now. Mm-hmm. The whole world's going crazy. Yes. I mean, that debate last night, I'm not going to get into a whole politics thing. <sighs> God bless you, Kamala Harris. Mm-hmm. But uh, she did a wonderful job. But I mean, it's scary with the prospects mm-hmm. of Project 2020. Oh, 1,000%. Yes. You know. And the fact that that is even a questionable debate of like, the fact that, that you could be on either side is like, I wow. Agree. Exactly. This is even a close race. It's a little shocking. I agree. Well, one thing that I <laughs> wanted to bring up right away from the start, and I know all of you girls want to talk about this, is we've been noticing that a lot of Triple X performers on Twitter and Instagram, mostly on Twitter, are getting shadow banned. Oh. Mm. And we put yeah. a post up, and where we used to put up a post and we maybe got 750 likes in oh, an yeah. hour. Yeah. There's maybe one like. Yes. Mm-hmm. We're not seen. Yes. Yeah. You know, I, I'm shadow banned as much as you can be to oh. where I had to make new accounts to, mm-hmm. like when I want to look myself up on someone's phone, like they ask what my um, socials are, I have to search my backups to then click on to yeah. go to my actual right. account. And so, I mean, I literally watched me follow someone three times on someone's phone, and it kept, it literally would bounce back to say yeah. follow. I'm like, no, follow. I'm like, no, nope, never mind. And you're like in perfectly yeah. fine service. Like, like it's not the them, service. Are they sure three times? Right. So like, they're fine. You know, Let them follow me. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes, like, you know, I'm uh, I'm in business for 12 years, and, like, you know, it was kind of time when, like, Instagram, like, just, like, start being, like, you know, super wild, like, and mm-hmm. things. For sure. And, uh, like, you know, and as of now, like, you know, I'm, like, constantly in shadow ban, like, for everything I'm saying, because, like, I have a big mouth, like, so, like, what, mm-hmm. is, what it is. Mm-hmm. And, so, like, you know, uh, <clears throat> 
Uh, now, like I decided, I delete like all the like say, super sexy stuff. Like you know, like I barely mm -hmm. have anything from my uh, like from my porn like career or anything. Just mm -hmm. like you know, something like with clothes, maximum with some bikini. Mm -hmm. uh, like only in that case, I can like you know, like save my account from being shadow banned. And like in other things, for example, it's enough for you. Like for example, you're not in in industry. Like you're like absolutely like normal people. Mm -hmm. But like it's enough like just to follow me and like couple people like me. Like it's already like you know like mm -hmm. like reason like to be shadow banned for you. Mm -hmm. So like they super strict and they use this like algorithm AI like whatever they do and it's absolutely not uh, set like for like what they like want to do because so uh, yeah because sometimes as I say like okay like I'm like you know like talk a lot of shit like some, most of the time but sometimes it's just like sexy picture which is shown uh, so much passion and stuff but like yeah you can like look at this you can say so and like this is already enough and I decided just like all right like if you don't want me to show it like for free to people like I'm gonna show it like for money in like my private accounts and stuff do you agree with that girls yeah I agree with it um yeah just my thing is after losing so many accounts like you know 10k and up I now find what? that oh yeah on Instagram so many times I'm, I'm on my probably 10th Instagram you know so it's so like you build now up all of these followers and then for no reason no at reason all, like I even Thanos lost my personal one. The Avengers snapping his finger and mm -hmm. they, you just disappear. They mm -hmm. took my personal yeah. Instagram, like from like my high school, you know. Yeah. They, they took that away just for being, yeah, for my I, IP address, yeah. it all being. Wow. So, yeah, I, of they course, like in your account, you're making it's like it's like immediately, so like you know, yeah. like, kind of, oh, like you know, related okay. to Thank your you. old one. I appreciate mm -hmm. it, but yeah. yeah. So now, what I was going at, where I was getting at, was. I find that I have to post a little bit more of the thirst trap, a little bit more of the, you know. But you know, mm -hmm. like, let me like uh, be honest about that. Yeah. Like, you know, I'm like, uh, how's how to say? Like, I'm kind of old school about it, and I still mm -hmm. believe that, like, in ancient century, like, women can seduce men like just showing their ankles. It's so true. And like so, and like you know, and by this moment, like you know, now like I'm visiting a lot of like charity parties and stuff, which is like not about porn, and there is kind of like you know, like Instagram girls and someone who is not like that. <laughs> so, but at the same time, like you know, I'm coming there in a beautiful dress, like you know, like in a style, like uh -huh. look like a princess, and they come in a stripper clothes. Mm -hmm. And like you know, and all the time I'm complaining, like you know, mm -hmm. why you offer me your titties without like giving me like any like you know moment for imagination? I love women, mm -hmm. like to the moon and back, like I have mm -hmm. wife. And like so, and like when I see already naked woman, and I'm like, okay, you gave me everything like you know yeah. like I, I'm a hunter like you know like I need like something like okay I want to see that like you know uh, like, give me this thirst trap like you yeah, show me I'm something a hunter? yes yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. she is a yes hunter. yes I don't like she's on the prowl you look like honestly I have my moments because mm -hmm. it's like you see celebrities who start in OnlyFans and stuff and like they're not showing anything more than what they're showing on Instagram but you get curious you so it's the do. fact that I can't just have it up my yeah like just disposal where it's uh -huh. like now I want it more Mm -hmm. It's yes. true. That's true. And I mean, yeah. are they going to go after the mainstream shows that are practically softcore porn out there? I mean, I you've mean, got a show, uh, Euphoria. Oh, my wow. God. Uh, I believe well, it's, you know, I believe it's be one yeah, of the yeah. biggest <laughs> sites of, like, hypocrisy. Because, you know, like, we are labeled by doing porn. And, like, you know, whatever you do, like, you can be an endlessly wonderful person. But you're doing porn, so, like, you're, like, a waste of humanity. But, like, when everything happens, like, in the mainstream, like, the, in some movies, like, you know, I can see, like, not just the TVs, like, some movies, like, show, like, even dick. And I'm like, oh, yes. <laughs> and, like, that's right, that's art. Yeah. So, and, like, you know, like, and, like, nobody can say, like, anything. Yeah, some people who's like, oh, my God, how dare you? But, no, it's a mainstream, it's a right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, like, so, we can do, like, we, we and do... And conservatives are our biggest audience for Triple X. Oh, Hello. And the biggest spenders. Oh, the oh, yeah. biggest oh, spenders. Oh, the <laughs> yes. What, 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 what was that <laughs> symbol you, you were doing? The, I don't know. I talk with my hands a little it's bit. Just the natural. biggest <laughs> Yeah, it's just... Well, like, I thought you were like, oh... <laughs> How conservative you said. Yes. Yes, Senator. Yeah. Well, supposedly, you know that guy, was it George? George Santos. Santos. Yes. He was appropriating all those that money from the donors. Mm -hmm. He was buying porn. Oh, yes. He was buying Only subscriptions. Fan subscriptions. Only yeah. fans. And there were a lot of us guys in porn. He was buying subscriptions to our thing mm -hmm. and write yeah. to us. Love it. Oh, would you mind like 
putting on an Estelle Getty wig and running around and going, I'm a naughty boy and jack off. And I go, okay, 500 bucks, fucker. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> right. I'm not going to call your name out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But you know, Americans, I think what in that case, like, it's about Some your, like, about punch. the rights. Because, <laughs> you know, like, yes, like, you know, wherever you do, it's like my private life, it's my private thing. So if I want to subscribe for someone and see, like, you know, like, their genitals and stuff, it's my thing. Because when I go to, like, you know, like, real life and doing my things, you know, like, yeah, I'm not showing, like, okay, here's my tits. Uh-huh. Yeah, and so, like, we have this, or like, no, it's all about rights. Like, we have, I'm doing my job well. I do, I adore her. But, like, so, why, like, what I have to do, like, what I'm doing in my private life, if I want to subscribe for you, like, I can't do this. Like, why, like, you know, like, everyone gonna judge me for that? Ah, you're a senator, you cannot do this. Like, that, we're all human beings. Yeah, 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 yeah. that makes a lot of sense. I like that. All right, yeah. <laughs> um, let me run down the line here. Do you remember your first scene? What was it like? Do you remember, Stella, your first scene? Okay, oh yeah, but you know, the, this is like, it's super controversial and I'm just going to share it. Um, it was totally, it was totally one of those, I got it off sexy jobs, okay? Like, literally what I did was Googled how to get into porn and it literally was like, just to go on sexy jobs. I mm-hmm. meet, yeah, okay, yeah, your face, it's crazy. No, because you end <laughs> so up going to an test- address in somebody's garage or something. No, I meet, up, I meet them in a hotel in New York and, um, you know, they paid me like a thousand dollars, like really, you know. And, and well, listen, but it was like That's than it the was girls getting, are getting now. They it get was $300 getting recorded. and a gift card to TJ Maxx. I mean, what I'm talking about. If that, if that, right? So, yeah, that was my first shoot. My first real shoot was um, strippers. Once I finally decided, yeah, because I went back and forth for a while, you know, okay. like. Yeah, the so then once company. I finally, oh yeah, first company, yeah, after that shady shit that I went through, uh, went on to do a few more of those before I shot finally with Rodney St. Cloud, mm-hmm. who does um, Strippers of in the Hood. That's Oh, yes, I've heard of him. Uh-huh, okay, yeah, yeah, cool. yeah, so that's a real, that's really, that's a fun and how shoot. how did you pick your name, your, your stage name? Okay, so corny, man. Stella, obviously, streetcar named Desire. Oh, okay. And then <laughs> Carter, there was like this band I was obsessed with. The lead singer's last name was Carter. And then, so, but now I kind of changed that. Now it's like Little Wayne, you know, Miss mm. Carter. Like, yeah. <laughs> you know, so I try to, I tried to clean it up a little, yeah. you know? Yeah. It's a good one. Cause I'm, thank you. It's a good one. <laughs> thank Tori you. Tori Easton, your mm-hmm. first scene, darling. My first scene, I was about four days into being 18. <sighs> I did my first ever studio scene, which was for Groupie. Um, I had, I mean, the day I turned 18, I went Groovy. on. Uh, yeah, I yeah. went on uh, live, and I was on live for like four days straight. And on like second day, everyone's like, you need to go shoot for Groovy. You need to go shoot for Groovy. And I oh, look it up, and I send them an best. email. And within two wow. days, I get an email that's like, come on down to LA, because I was up in San Luis Obispo at the time. And came down and did my first four scenes I think and then I didn't really shoot for another year and then at 19 I signed with Next Level and that's when I started full time that's right congratulations yeah (laughs) Next Level is a mainstream uh, Mm triple X agency yes but you were the first TIA performer that they ever saw oh my gosh congratulations (laughs) thank you and that's Andre and Jonathan Mm -hmm. yes who are both directors mm-hmm. who used to direct me back in the day. Yes, no, I owe both of those men so much because, Aww. I mean, they really did take a chance oh, they, with me. Uh, and, and they're real innovators yeah. and pioneers. And, I mean, they just treated me the same way they would treat anyone else. And they were just like, we like you, mm-hmm. and we see you have the same potential with anyone else, and come on, let's do it. Yeah. See how it works? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How did you yes. pick the name Tori Easton? Well, my real name is actually Victoria Easton. Oh, so brave! Yeah. Well, we all said that at the brave. same time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Tori's so cute. Yeah. I love that. Thank you. That's a good little altar. Oh. <laughs> this is my favorite reward. It's like, yeah. a, dog. <laughs> it's like a little. Dog nap. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 Dragon treats. All right, and you just shot a scene uh, with Foxy recently, she told me, yes? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Okay. It was great. I love Foxy. Okay, cool. <laughs> now, 
the lovely Crystal Rush. Do you remember your first scene? Oh, yeah. There was a whole different thing back then when so you started. It was a whole different country back then. Yeah. <laughs> I started in Russia, like, so, and, like, as oh, I was, I, all oh. the time I'm, I'm saying, like, if you start doing porn in Russia, you do this out of love to porn, not, like, for yes, money. Yes, yes, yes. Because, like, yeah, come on, it's Russia, like, corruption and, like, cheap shit is all and around. she didn't have the tits. Uh, yeah, I was, like, yeah, I was 24 mm -hmm. at this time, like, you know, and I just, like, you know, get divorced, like, you know, moved to big city, and, like, so, I, and I was thinking, what I'm pervert as fuck. Yeah. I'm so naughty and slutty and things, yeah. and I remember I'm like, all right, let's like let's try it. I was thinking about like three months or something to do or not to do. Mm -hmm. So it was two options: do like an escort or like porn. But I was like, so, uh, like kind of obsessed with porn, mm -hmm. like from like 15 years old. I'm uh -huh. like, fuck the escort. I don't want to serve people. But like you know, like yeah. I will about the porn. I'm like, damn, I want to feel what this woman feel. I want to try it and stuff. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And eventually, so I said yes. I came to St. Petersburg, which is second capital of like Russia. Mm -hmm. And I remember the first thing it was just regular boy girl, like you know, just like a yeah, classic. One and uh, the, it started from the moment like guy sitting in the couch and I just have to walk behind and touch his shoulder and it was like <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah and, yeah in this moment I realized what like I, I'm not fucking perfect that <laughs> <laughs> maybe compared to people like from my town and something like yes I am mm -hmm. but like for porn like I was like so like ah, such a flower yes, <laughs> yes. Such, a flower. such a little flower mm. now um, how did you come about the name of Crystal Rush as your adult so, name. Again, like get back to like young and naive and stupid and stuff. So like at that time, I like you know I even even didn't know like you know what all this like you know huge industries like that and you have to like pick the name and do all mm -hmm. that stuff. Like for me, like okay, you should pour like you go. And <laughs> after like you know like several like videos, like you know, it was like kind of like package of these that we try like like oh, everything. They're like all right, like now we're going to send your videos to production. So like you have you have to pick a name, and I'm like what what name? Like what the fuck you're talking about? Mm -hmm. They're like you have to pick your stage name, and I'm like. Oh my God! What to do? What to do? And like you know, and immediately I start like you know like thinking. But as you know, like sometimes like when you like think like immediately, like it's like kind of like good ideas come to your mind or like mm -hmm. what you want more. And like, maybe you remember the movie Show Girls of um, 1995. Yeah. Like where is this was like you know this it's why? Like with Berkeley. Oh, uh, yes, and there is, yeah. was another stripper, like, she was, like, a brunette, like, Crystal Connors. Mm -hmm. And I was obsessed with this woman. She was, like, so graceful, like, mm -hmm. like the way she talked, the way she walked. Like, I remember, I was a teenager, and I was, like, <laughs> Yeah, and, like, How you know. Did you go again? <laughs> yeah, and so, and she was like the first woman like who came into my mind, I'm like, God damn, I want to be that crystal. And like, you know, like, to become like crystal corners, it was like a little bit too much of the copy-paste, and I'm like, I want to be like, rush, rush. Yeah, fucking Russian, like, yeah. 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 <laughs> Very good. Love it. Wow. There's some stuff you guys didn't know. All right, we're going to break away for a commercial break right now. We're going to be back with what you want to know from our good friends at the mall.sexy. We've got some uh, special questions that fans sent in. And then we'd love to hear from you out there. So you can call us at 818-231-2580. But wait for the commercial break. And we'll be back with a lot more right after this. Scenes to watch. But how do I know where and what to watch? I mean, I only want the best stuff out there. James, don't worry. It's all at the mall.sexy. There's more than just shopping here. There's movies, adult star profiles, and much more. Plus, you can hear What You Must Watch, updated every Wednesday on Inside the Industry Radio, every Wednesday night, and on the Inside the Industry Roku TV channel. You see, everything is there. Go check it out today, the mall.sexy. Are you feeling like the spark has fizzled out in your relationship? Has the excitement between you and your partner taken a back seat? Well, don't worry, you're not alone. Many couples experience a dip in desire over time, but guess what? There's a solution that can reignite that flame and bring back the passion you once had. Introducing Shivers, the revolutionary sexual enhancement gummy for both men and women. Yes, you heard it right, for men and women. Shivers is here to help you and your partner rediscover that sizzle in your relationship. Now picture this, you and your partner feeling sexy, confident, and absolutely irresistible. That's the power of Shivers. Our specially formulated gummies are designed to help you feel more aroused, increase sensitivity, enhance your libido, and get you in the mood for some steamy nights ahead. Oh my goodness. Kiss me. Wow. <laughs> but 
that's not all. Shivers isn't just about the physical. It's about reigniting that emotional connection with your partner. Say goodbye to those days of feeling distant or disinterested. With Shivers, you'll both be eager and excited to explore each other's desires once again. Oh my! Don't let a lackluster libido dull your relationship any longer. Try Shivers today and let the passion take over. Shivers, because every moment together should be electric. Available now at Shivers.store. That's Shivers.store. If you like your cartoons, comics, animated porn, and games that are hot, raw, and uncensored, well then check out DukesHardcoreHoneys.com. That's DukesHardcoreHoneys.com. You can see the sexiest erotic stories that feature curvy women, milfs, busty teens, and well-hung studs. There's superhero porn, horror porn, and suspense porn, monster porn, and horny housewives. With hundreds of videos, games, and thousands of comics, you'll be guaranteed to come back and have a great time. Plus, check out the new Twisted Tales animation line, featuring the voice talents of some of the most popular stars in the adult entertainment industry today. And coming this summer, they'll be adding some new hardcore VR animated porn scenes onto the site as well. So check out DukesHardcoreHoneys.com. You won't be disappointed. That's DukesHardcoreHoneys.com. It's time again for the exciting Exotica Expos. And Exotica 2024 is going to be bringing you so much more for you to discover and experience this year. Here are the dates for 2024, so make your plans now to attend. Chicago will be April 12th, 13th, and 14th. Miami will be June 28th, 29th, and 30th. New Jersey will be October 25th, 26th, and 27th. And Washington, D.C., December 6th, 7th, and 8th. Exotica 2024 will again be featuring the biggest stars in the adult entertainment industry with fun and informative seminars, stage performances, product vendors, webcam girls, the Exotica Dungeon Experience, Couples X Lifestyle Experience, and so much more. And remember, ladies get in free on Fridays. For the ultimate Exotica experience, try the three-day VIP pass and go VIP. Tickets are available at ExoticaExpo.com. To see the stars attending, see the seminar schedules, see the list of vendors and booths, and get information on all of the after parties, go to ExoticaExpo.com. Exotica Expo, number one in the U.S. for over 17 years. Remember that site and visit them today. ExoticaExpo.com mm, Welcome back. It's Inside the Industry with James Bartolet. Mmm, we got all sort of yummy food here. And even yummier guests. Yeah. Crystal, Tori, and Stella are on the air with us now. You can call in and talk to us live. 818, is it 818? No. Thank you. 818-231-2580. Once again, that's 818-231-2580. Call from anywhere in the world that you're watching the show now. Um, you can watch us live, not just on that Facebook page that I have, but you can also watch us live on our Roku TV channel. Wow. Yes, we have a 24-hour Roku TV channel. It's like E, but with lube. So, <laughs> oh, E has lots of lube. But, oh, <laughs> get it, Brian, get me some more lube. <laughs> so yes, um, so we have a 24-hour channel, and Edric just added on a new thing on Old School Cool. It's old interviews I did with my 
old TV show, LA Nightlife, interviews with Fee Wable and the Tubes, uh, Anna Lewin and Bow Wow Wow, and more great interviews. They're all showing up on there. Mm -hmm. New cooking segments on Foodies TV. And also, Porn Star Game Night is up now. We have a game show network on Inside the Industry, James Bartley. It's called Porn Star Game Night. Crystal, you played this before. Oh, really? Like, I just, like, try, I was, like, was about to ask, like, what the game is, and, like, I already played it. No, you remember, we did it over at the, at the Exotica. We went up on, on the stage there, and we did the games. Yes, I think so. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember. You know, I remember we did the. Le I remember like I we did the lectures about how to get to the industry and Here, stuff. But I have another spark shot. Yeah, like <laughs> I'm like, yeah, like, almost like I'm like I need to refresh. Did it. you see this? By the way, kids, we've got these cute little things here. It's fifteen. Do a little. Mm -hmm. It got a little mine, unfortunately. And it's liquid. <laughs> it's a liquid liqueur, and it comes in the little sperm bottles there. Yes. Okay, anyway, Point Star Game Night, lots of cool games like you would have on a we regular will kill game his show. <laughs> the, there you go. Oh, Miami! <laughs> Exotica! What, what is that? Oh, are you just playing a clip of it? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but it's like really cool, and a game that I invented, it's called Suck and Blow. I so love it. The fans are on one side, and they suck up a marshmallow with a straw, then they run across the stage, and then put the marshmallow in the cup that the girl's holding in her cleavage. Sounds easy, but it's very difficult to do. Yeah. But that and, of course, tonight's episode and archives and a lot more expo coverage. It's all on Inside the Industry with James Bartolet, Roku TV channel, or watch us on our official website, InsideTheIndustry.net, and you can watch the show live on there. <laughs> Speaking of Exotica, we are coming up very closely now to Exotica, New Jersey. It's going to be October 25th, 26th, and 27th in Edison, New Jersey. You out there can get a chance to win a free ticket to go. It's like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. Five lucky kitties out there, adults, are going to get a chance to go to this wonderful event that is Exotica, New Jersey. All these stars. There's going to be over 100 stars and cam stars there that are going to be there. And you're going to love it. Okay? So you can win a free ticket to go. It must be 21 and over to enter. Just send an email to insidecontest at gmail.com and put Exotica Contest in the header. And also, I am still giving away, I've got 15, more, I added on 15 more seats uh, for the screening for Scissors next Tuesday, September 17th. That's gonna be at the Regal Theater in the Sherman Oaks Galleria. This is a beautiful um, state-of-the-art movie theater uh, place to see your movies. And we're gonna be in there, I rented out this big, huge theater to watch the screening of the movie. The red carpet is 6 to 7 p.m. The movie is 7 to about 8, 15 p.m. It's a shorter movie, but it's very scary. 95% mm -hmm. um, of the cast is adult stars, but they're good actors, and it's a great horror movie. I'm one of the stars in the movie, and I'm an executive producer. Oh, I bet they great. scream like the best. Oh, Don't no. kill me! <laughs> yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's really good. It's called Scissors. I'm sure you've seen the trailer online, but if you would like to go to the premiere, write into Inside Contest at gmail.com. How's the action in the um, chat room there, Edric? Uh, let's see. Somebody would like you to read uh, Crystal to read aloud from a calculus textbook. Sure. What? what? They would <laughs> like Crystal to read from a calculus textbook. textbook. Yeah, they want to hear some math equations. Apparently, it would be erotic. Wow. Ah, oh yeah. I прям даже не знаю что делать. Of course, you know, you, you can come to my, like, OnlyFans or sex partner and, like, I will read the textbook, phone book, like, you know, like, some, like, you know, geometry and stuff, like, whatever you want me to do. Mm -hmm. I like to read, but sometimes I read bullshit, but it makes it even better. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, that's how sexy her voice is. Yeah. You just read something yeah. and make a good jack off to it. Mm -hmm. That's on Sex Panther, <laughs> right? 
Yeah, like call me and talk to me, and like you know something like you know like uh, since like I'm Russian and like you know all my life I was the normal like you know like well like now I'm exotic so like, yeah I'll take it I'll take yeah. it when you know, yeah <laughs> and so and, like you know all the time it's all about my accent and like you know, when like you know I'm doing like some shoots like you know I'm cursing in Russian mm -hmm. and stuff That's and like so you know it's so hard <laughs> people okay like can you like you know like you talk during Russian I'm like guys you know the point is when you talk during Russian it sounds so ridiculous yeah and like I remember it was like beginning of my career and it was like some Japanese company they shoot like very weird porn and stuff and it have to be hand job and during hand job I have to like say something at that time my English was horrible oh. and like, like you can speak something in Russian it's all right and I was doing poetry and just <laughs> 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 Mary has a little <laughs> yeah like you know poetry like from the school program or something in Russian like you know I was reading it like you know I was like reading this like you know nice so, like you know like it was like you know like all this like emphasizing like of everything <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I wish I can find it. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so, so funny. <laughs> can you do a Hungarian accent, do you think? Uh, I'm not sure because, you know, like, I, I'm psyched at accents and stuff because sometimes I'm like, you know, Hungarian language sounds for me what they like, you know, I fucking hate you. <laughs> no, because I was thinking, because in this <laughs> outfit, doesn't she not look like Ava Gabor in Green Acres? I she mean, super I could does. be Howard uh, uh, Wendell, the mm -hmm. husband, we're like, Green Acres Triple X for me. <laughs> we like DPs all day and night. You know, yeah, it's, it's great. Yeah. Such okay, a wonderful now, song. Are you on Sex Panther? Um, I am not. Oh, okay. yeah. 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 we have to. Gotta get you on there. Are you on yeah. Sex Panther? Hell yeah. Yeah. It's I'm on so Panther funny. Piss. Panther so Piss. So I just piss off. People. I, I knew you always like <laughs> further than us, yeah. yeah. It's really cool. Here, have some bruschetta. All right, 818-231-2580, um, phone number, please call in right now. Uh, let's ask some questions here from some fans here. Um, Tori, who is your favorite male talent that you've worked with so far? My Ooh. favorite male talent is Michael Del Rey. Michael Del Rey. Good friend of mine. We actually live together, we're roommates. Oh, <laughs> yes. okay. But yeah, no, he's my favorite. He's just so fun to be on set with, which is like honestly kind of the biggest thing for, for me. Sure. Yeah. I don't care how hot you are, I don't care is how good you are also? in bed. Yeah, we're he's a little bit shorter than me, but like you know, Maybe can't ask really, for yeah, you know, yeah, too yeah. much. Yeah. 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 But still, not compared to this short stuff here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> it's like she's so tall, you have to climb up a ladder, kiss her, then come down. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Okay, now what about you, darling? Oh, favorite male question. talent. Yes. Well, favorite male talent. Yeah, let's go to that. Oh, my gosh. That's so tough. I don't like anyone. Fight them. <laughs> <laughs> right? Well, I hope oh, you can still use man. it. Uh, <laughs> you know what? Yeah, you can. Um, I don't have anyone in particular at the moment. Okay. Yeah. How about a girl? You know what? I haven't really been. Um, How about your favorite sex toy? <laughs> <laughs> that one's easy. Okay. The classic, Hitachi. Hitachi, <laughs> there you go. All right. Crystal Rush, your yeah. favorite male or female performance? Uh, so, work? like, favorite male, uh, it. Tyler, Tyler Nixon, I would say. Tyler Nixon? Yeah, because, like, Good he's point. like a sex toy. Like, you know, yeah. like, he's, like, you know, he's it to your life. <laughs> <laughs> he's a Love that. Yeah. Was he the one that played. My yes, son. it's exactly one like which is like movie which is like uh, collect more than twenty million views. First movie like we ever did together, <laughs> and mm. she was my uh, Russian wife, and my son goes and fucks his Russian. He took his Viagra, time. get born her, and then I'm like, okay, fuck me, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. hot. It was very good. It was very cute. Okay, um, Stella Carter, the guy, one of our uh, fans and listeners, said. Um, he states, uh, with 16 IFAD, uh, IAFD credits, one third of them are for anal scenes. As a performer, are those the scenes you prefer? Yeah, I like doing extreme wild stuff. Yeah, you like the anal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm setting in sources. That's well, very. Yeah. Wow, that was very yeah. nice. Of you do anal all the time. They oh, did their yeah, research. So I hear. Yeah. Yeah. So I hear. <laughs> Word on the street. Yeah. Um, and have you done anal scenes yet? Oh my God, what is that? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Of course. 
course, you know, like I start like again, like I start doing porn in, porn in Russia, and like you know, if to get back to Sigmund Freud, Russia have like this anal fixation, and like you know, like at the beginning, yes. like yes, I had a few like show sure, like uh, like, but mostly oral fixation, but still like everything to death, and uh, like you know, I had a less like you know the regular boy girl, like then like uh, the, then like you know like boy girl anal, and it mm -hmm. was like boy girl anal, 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 then like you know like it was like you know all of the, the time, and I'm like, is this like any porn with no anal? Like yeah, maybe sometimes. Yeah. And I love how she says anal. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm Russian, like, I you know, like, you know, like, in Russia, so it's fun. like anal, 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 like, yeah. Yeah. Like, All right, next question here. Um, a guy says, it's a pleasure to see you again on Inside the Industry. Um, you were in a many vids production of Accidental Cream Pie in Russian Escort Crystal Rush. Do you well, that scene well uh, I don't remember exact, exactly this scene, like, no, like, especially, like, you know, when it's, like, have some name, I'm like, you like, you really think I remember the name of a porn, like, come on. Mm. Like, like, thanks mm. God to remember productions, like, it's yeah. good. Yeah. But, uh, Have you done cream pie? Oh, uh, usually, like, I'm not doing cream pie and stuff, like, you know, yeah. and, like, you know, I'm still at that age, like, when I can get pregnant and I don't want to deal with that shit, so, like, no, fuck that shit. Okay. But if you saw and if you believe what it was accidental, that means I get a great job. Because if it really will be accidental, I believe, like, this guy will be dead right now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> because like come on like yeah. you know like you yeah. know can you imagine I like you know it, like yeah. to come inside some woman yeah of course like as for now like we have this like young girls like you know like who's just like turned like into 18 and eat bunch of like birth control shit and stuff and mm. after we see like what they have pregnant the problem like you know like with all this hormone system and mm -hmm. stuff like come so on they can't do a cream pie if they're on birth control no they can i mean they can but the problem oh, is like the birth control like is changing your <laughs> it's changing oh, wow. it's changing your hormone system and stuff yeah. And the thing is, like, you know, I'm not saying, like, don't do this and stuff, but the thing yeah. is how people, like, live their, like, live their life. You know, yeah. it's like, you know, like, for example, like, you know, like, you take that pill, then you, like, go to take drugs, then you get drunk, like, uh, tomorrow you forget the pill, after tomorrow you take the two and yeah. stuff. And so, and this is, like, fuck it up. And, you know, and after, like, you know, it's, it's, it can cause a lot of problems and stuff. Like, you know, I'm not taking that shit. Like, yeah, fuck that, like, me neither. Yeah, and so, and, like, uh, and I don't know, like, you know, I live in that stuff, like, you know, I love that stuff, like, you know, for example, like, come on, like, you know, if I want somebody to come inside of me, like, you know, like, I, I have to lie that person, not like fucking everyone, like, you know, I don't want your DNA, like, everywhere yeah. on me. Yeah. <laughs> you know, let's, I, I know that we have a lot of, we have a lot more female uh, listeners mm -hmm. and viewers on there. Oh, okay. And I know that there's a lot of women at home that are thinking about, if they haven't yet, introducing anal into their sexual repertoire at home. What advice would you tell them? So the first of all, like about like let's get back to like this like common side and stuff. I heard like from a lot of young girls like I don't like to like you know like him pulling out and coming with me. I like to feel it. I'm like what the fuck like you're exactly feeling like come on. So uh, yeah, like you know for like you know like yeah when you like you know like when you're coming inside of woman yeah like you fucking feel it. But like yes like I know that. But like come on like you know like it's like you know most of the time it's about to please other people. Mm -hmm. No like when you like want to like but you know it's again like I'm not saying it's good or bad but like. You no, don't let to do this to everyone. Dog. Yeah, it's like, I'm about this, like, you know, like, come on, like, you know, you're not this, like, you know, like, French fries and McDonald's, like, no, come on, like, you know, like, <laughs> yeah, and so, and it's about, like, you know, so, about anal sex, like, you know, in private life, and, like, you know, when you want to invent, and, like, you know, for example, even, like, not to get pregnant, or, like, you know, discover something new and stuff, fuck, yes, do this, because, like, you know, like, you know, like, come on, like, you know, when you try to do this with a person, like, you trust, you like, you like, you like, you're kind of, like, okay with sizes and stuff, and, like, you mm -hmm. know, and, of course, if you don't, like, believe, like, in porn from the beginning, what like, you know, somebody with that dick can, like, smoothly get in. <laughs> this, that's bullshit. That mm -hmm. doesn't work. Yeah, and so, like, and of course, you got to try it. And, like, you know, like, maybe, like, you know, you will learn what it's something you like. Because, you know, like, how are you going to know until you try it, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. That's very true. Girls, what would you mm -hmm. say? You know uh, what? Yeah, go ahead. About being cummed in? Come <laughs> well, I mean, trying anal for the first time. Oh, uh, maybe light a candle. Um, <laughs> Just yeah, make it hot. Yeah, I mean, I hear that's a thing. Right. Yeah. Oh, we had that scene at the end of Pirates, <laughs> the first Pirates movie, and it was Jesse Jane, the late Jesse Jane. Wow. God bless, God bless you, her. And Janine. And they had the scene with the candle, the two gals. Mm -hmm. But when she did the pussy fart, the blue flame came out. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's know. so cool. I'm kidding. <laughs> 
But Dragon pussy. Oh my god, that's a like, oh shit. That is dangerous. <laughs> like lit candles as dildos? Mm -hmm. No, of course, I because it can dream like inside and it can burn like so. I love so a little like circus act. Yeah, me yeah. too. What's I that? mean, like, you know, like, yes, it can be dangerous because if it drip like close to, like, you know, it can burn it. But, you know, everyone was doing waxing because, like, you know, before, like, you know, like, all mm. laser, like, came up. So, like, it's still all right. But, yes, like, candles and, like, you know, even something. Oh, so you can have sex and then do the uh, Brazilian wax job. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if you are multitasking, why not? Might as well. Why not? Yeah. I ask you, Stella, why? Oh. I couldn't help but wonder. What about you? You got advice for anal for the young girls out there? You know what? It's it sucks because like it anal. Sucks? Well, Is no, that no, no. Better for anal. <laughs> Okay. It's it's the worst because Suck the ass. anal prep. <laughs> right? Am I correct me if I'm wrong? It's especially for porn. It's not you know it's not fun. It's not fun unless, you know, I feel like somebody, you know, they're going to be worried about certain things happening and stuff. Mm -hmm. I mean, maybe just take Imodium. <laughs> like, I was going to say, like, if you Imodium. do your research, do the proper prep, you're yeah. going to have a much better time. Oh, oh yeah, oh, and, yeah. and like lots of lube. And if you're just praying on that candle. Don't, coconut don't oil. Don't come home drunk and say, what Well, and you know, like, actually, like, you know, preparation for <laughs> yeah. a professional scene and preparation for, like, you know, like, regular, like, you know, like, anal sex in your life, it's, it's might be a little different. Mm -hmm. Because when you do this professionally, yes. you, you have to clean it till, like, you know, you can drink so out you of can there. Drink yes, out but, of like, it. you know, when you, like, doing this, like in, like in your real life, you yeah. know, like you just have to like free, like you know, like this somehow into space, yeah. like you know, don't like make it like you know, like too much, and like don't yeah. fuck right after, like at least for a couple right. hours to don't get like any like you know, like pain. Yeah, yeah. ain't as much scare here. Start with a finger, <laughs> like you know, like and yes, don't you know, eat just wise. Yes, yes, especially yeah. spicy food. Yeah. <laughs> Unless he like did something messy while. Yeah, like some people like tingle. <laughs> ding, ding. Could be dangerous. All right. On that note, let's go to a commercial break. <laughs> and we'll be back with a lot more right after this. Bon appetit. Yes. <laughs> Ari, you know what? I'm so confused. There's so many porn scenes to watch. James, where did you get it? I don't know where and what to watch. I mean, I only want the best stuff out there. James, don't worry. It's all at the mall.sexy. There's more than just shopping here. There's movies, adult star profiles, and much more. Plus, you can hear What You Must Watch, updated every Wednesday on Inside the Industry Radio, every Wednesday night, and on the Inside the Industry Roku TV channel. You see, everything is there. Go check it out today, the mall.sexy. Are you feeling like the spark has fizzled out in your relationship? Has the excitement between you and your partner taken a back seat? Well, don't worry, you're not alone. Many couples experience a dip in desire over time. But guess what? There's a solution that can reignite that flame and bring back the passion you once had. Introducing Shivers, the revolutionary sexual enhancement gummy for both men and women. Yes, you heard it right, for men and women. Shivers is here to help you and your partner rediscover that sizzle in your relationship. Now picture this, you and your partner feeling sexy, confident, and absolutely irresistible. That's the power of Shivers. Our specially formulated gummies are designed to help you feel more aroused, increase sensitivity, enhance your libido, and get you in the mood for some steamy nights ahead. But that's not all. Shivers isn't just about the physical. It's about reigniting that emotional connection with your partner. Say goodbye to those days of feeling distant or disinterested. With Shivers, you'll both be eager and excited to explore each other's desires once again. Aww. Oh my! Don't let a lackluster libido dull your relationship any longer. Try Shivers today and let the passion Ari, you know what? I'm so confused. There's so many porn scenes to watch, but how do I know where and what to watch? I mean, I only want the best stuff out there. James, don't worry. It's all at the mall.sexy. There's more than just shopping here. 
There's movies, adult star profiles, and much more. Plus, you can hear What You Must Watch, updated every Wednesday on Inside the Industry Radio, every Wednesday night, and on the Inside the Industry Roku TV channel. You see, everything is there. Go check it out today, themall.sexy. Are you feeling like the spark has fizzled out in your relationship? Has the excitement between you and your partner taken a back seat? Well, don't worry, you're not alone. Many couples experience a dip in desire over time. But guess what? There's a solution that can reignite that flame and bring back the passion you once had. Introducing Shivers, the revolutionary sexual enhancement gummy for both men and women. Yes, you heard it right, for men and women. Shivers is here to help you and your partner rediscover that sizzle in your relationship. Now picture this, you and your partner feeling sexy, confident, and absolutely irresistible. That's the power of Shivers. Our specially formulated gummies are designed to help you feel more aroused, increase sensitivity, enhance your libido, and get you in the mood for some steamy nights ahead. But that's not all. Shivers isn't just about the physical. It's about reigniting that emotional connection with your partner. Say goodbye to those days of feeling distant or disinterested. With Shivers, you'll both be eager and excited to explore each other's desires once again. Oh my! Don't let a lackluster libido dull your relationship any longer. Try Shivers today and let the passion take over. Shivers, because every moment together should be electric. Available now at shivers.store. That's shivers.store. If you like your cartoons, comics, animated porn, and games that are hot, raw, and uncensored, well then check out dukeshardcorehoneys.com. That's dukeshardcorehoneys.com. You can see the sexiest erotic stories that feature curvy women, milfs, busty teens, and well-hung studs. There's superhero porn, horror porn, and suspense porn, monster porn, and horny housewives. With hundreds of videos, games, and thousands of comics, you'll be guaranteed to come back and have a great time. Plus, check out the new Twisted Tales animation line, featuring the voice talents of some of the most popular stars in the adult entertainment industry today. And coming this summer, they'll be adding some new hardcore VR animated porn scenes onto the site as well. So check out dukeshardcorehoneys.com. You won't be disappointed. That's dukeshardcorehoneys.com. It's time again for the exciting Exotica Expos. And Exotica 2024 is going to be bringing you so much more for you to discover and experience this year. Here are the dates for 2024, so make your plans now to attend. Chicago will be April 12th, 13th, and 14th. Miami will be June 28th, 29th, and 30th. New Jersey will be October 25th, 26 and 27 and Washington DC December 6th, 7th and 8th. Exotica 2024 will again be featuring the biggest stars in the adult entertainment industry with fun and informative seminars, stage performances, product vendors, webcam girls, the Exotica dungeon experience, couples X lifestyle experience and so much more. And remember, ladies get in free on Fridays. For the ultimate Exotica experience, try the three-day VIP pass and go VIP. Tickets are available at ExoticaExpo.com. To see the stars attending, see the seminar schedules, see the list of vendors and booths, and get information on all of the after parties, go to ExoticaExpo.com. 
Exotica Expo, number one in the U.S. for over 17 years. Remember that site and visit them today, ExoticaExpo.com. You know what I think I'm going to do for my birthday? It's the 10th of October, but the 9th we're going to do a broadcast the night before. So I'm going to do a little homage, remembrance to my dear friend Hugh Hefner. And we're going to do like a little Playboy After Dark thing here. So we'll have a nice party. Shiny red. So I'll have all of you stars, all of you who can make it down. You should be back by then, so you should be able to make it. No, I mean, like, I believe, like I'm, I'm leaving just for one week. And, yeah, and you'll be, be back. In LA, like, you'll be for, back like, by the night. Like, for a long yeah. time. So if you girls are back in town, please come on. And then you fans out there, you can uh, win a chance to be in the little studio audience and hang on and be extras in this big fun show that we're going to do. It. Right into insidecontest at gmail.com. No, you're not going to get laid. <laughs> no, you don't have to get tested. You just get to hang out just with brush your, teeth and your clean favorite your nails. stars. That's all. <laughs> yes, That's all we deodorant ask. is a good idea, <laughs> yes. All right, it is time now for what you want to, what you must watch from our good friends at the mall.sexy. Remember, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, the mall has it all. Now, here's some movies besides buying things on the mall.sexy. You can also watch movies. So check out this movie with Clara Trinity and the del delicious little Layla Jenner. And it's a little movie called Multi-Orgasmic 10. Also with Charlie Summer and Coco Lovelock, who used to go by mm -hmm. Coco Loves Cock. <gasps> then they changed it to Coco Lovelock. Interesting little mm -hmm. trivia there. Next time you're playing uh, Triple X uh, Trivia Pursuit. Yes, you know that. Um, so check out this movie. It's called Big Game, The A. Charlie Summer Story. Then there's Cravings, Volume 3, with Anna Claire Clouds and Apollonia Laparia and the very gorgeous Miss Eve Sweet. All right, and the career prospective this week on the mall.sexy is the beautiful Miss Nina Mercedes. I've known her for so long. She's from Corpus Christi, Texas. Um, she had these big, natural, giant breasts and beautiful, curvy, gorgeous Latina woman. Um, she's retired now, but she was a big star and, and always in, in, in demand all the time, always in the time. Um, she was a vivid girl. Um, God, there was a, so many movies I did for Vivid way back in the day. I think I did one with her. Yes, I did. Yeah. How dare uh, you some of the movies. <laughs> and so Marnie. Um, here's a movie here you could go check out that she did with Haley Page and Katie Morgan and Mason Storm. And it's called Out of Control. Also, Sexual Icon with Devin Michaels and Nina Mercedes. And Lay Me Down with Nicolette Sheridan and Cherokee. Wow, there's another name from the mm -hmm. past. He was so sexy, right? Yeah, great girl. Find that and a whole lot more at mall.sexy. Also, go check out our good friends at Shivers. And I think we have some right over there, don't we? Yes, I've we do. I've stole one already. Do like yes. <laughs> Shivers.store. Put in the promo code ITI. Simple to remember because you're watching and listening to Inside the Industry. And you get the female and male enhancement. Gummies. Okay. Just take one because you'll be all like, don't you want me, baby? You're going to be crazy. Don't you want me, motherfucker? <laughs> you go again. Motherfucker, the... exactly. <laughs> well, you step, and then you step on their balls with high heels. Like, I told you, you do. <laughs> no, I'm nice. Like, come yeah. on. Like, you know, like, I, I cannot hurt people without them. Like, you know, deserve it. 
<laughs> now also check out our wonderful sponsors at exoticaexpos.com. Um, they have the 420 Expo that's coming up before the ABN uh, Expo. So yes. that's coming up very soon there. This weekend. What? This weekend. This weekend. Oh, right. wow. It's this weekend. Time is flying. Is Let what? me this just start by saying. The 420 Expo out there oh. at the New Jersey. Where they oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Edison. Yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh. And gosh. then so Exotica, Exotica literally mm -hmm. four weeks right after that. Yeah. Holy shit. And then also our great friends over at Duke's Hardcore Honeys. And that's where we have Twisted Tales. Number one animated project that's out on there right now stars Crystal Rush right over there and Isaiah Maxwell. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Called like Vampire Ship. Yes, I fuck him in a cartoon. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> It's Vampire Ship. It's very cool. We just wrapped production on Lulu in Wonderland. It's Lulu Chu and incredible all star cast in that. Alice in Wonderland, but instead of going into Wonderland, she goes into a video game. Love it. Yes. Uh, we it's did like Tangle Mario Kart. based on Rapunzel. Love that oh. too. That's and awesome. And the prince, and I'm climbing up the castle to oh the my princess. Hair. Place hard. Yeah. And I get yeah, over the top. That's fucking hot. I get over the top, I get in the window, and I go, what the fuck? And the hair no, she let I... down was for her pubes. Oh <laughs> my god, that's so awesome. I love it. Yeah. No. <laughs> that's a pretty wild one. Yeah. That's with Alec Cole and Christy. Canyon, and there's so many good oh, ones I'm there. Uh, yeah, but you were wonderful in that. You know, I was one of the like you know like beginners, like you know like from all this like things. So just why like yeah, yeah, like, yeah, like give me this moment for a bit, like you know because like yeah, we were first, and now like I truly believe yeah. with like you know a lot of great like you know cartoons, like with a lot of this like wonderful voiceovers and stuff. Uh, yeah, like, will be out, and I remember mm -hmm. how like you know we were recording this, and so and still smile, like you know like in English, like it's not my like you know native language, mm -hmm. and I remember like I was reading this like couple days in a row before, like you know to do not make the stupid mistakes. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, so like yeah, like it's still like you know. You make that same sound when you're uh, gagging on cock too. We all do. Yeah. Yeah. You, so know? you know. Why I have to speak it's a universal like sound. It's a, it was, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Right for your soul, Claire. Sure <laughs> You're not like so a you, a, you a, have a, no a, gag you like give me flex. Video, yes, yeah. You do you or you don't? Much? I don't. Okay, well, so you, you like, could I, just I make the sound put a like Subaru down. Yeah. Yeah. My left side, like, you know, like, through here, uh -huh. but, like, my right side, I don't know. For example, when I lay on you from, like, your right side and will suck dick from that way, I can fucking swallow this, oh like, you gosh. know. But, like, when I do it in other way, like, you know, like, it's, yes, like, harder it's for me. Position. In other way, like, I like it, like, you know, when my hand, like, you know, hanging from the, the bed. bed. Me or, like, too. when I'm sitting next to the bed and you're, like, in bed with me, like that. Yeah. You know, like, so it's go, go straight like, down your throat. Oh, I yeah, love like, that. You know, I remember, like, you know, people say, like, I can't do it anyway. I'm like, you're fantastic. Yeah. Like, you know, like, I just, yeah, like, you know, I have my answer. Tori, you're yeah, falling I, in love I with her, too. aren't you? Like, yeah. I think my throat is like, <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. no. you, you two should do a scene together. Well, I think I all three of you should do a scene together. <laughs> You know? Yeah, that would be hot. I think the three of you should do the a scene together. I think that would be great. You think so? Now, are you girls doing on your OnlyFans or your mini vids? Are you doing a Halloween themed special for that? Oh, I mean, oh, Halloween yeah. is just around the corner, ladies. You know what? That's a good. Mm -hmm. That was a good question. Um, I never really. Do I never do like a Halloween special? I would usually do more of, you know, like the week before posting just Halloween mm -hmm. stuff. But maybe I should do it for you the whole month of October. Yeah. You know, and shoot it now. Yeah, shoot it now. Because exactly. then you've got a whole month to air it instead mm -hmm. of just that one week. I just filmed I Christmas stuff yeah. last week. <laughs> yeah. Just because the outfit, you know, I, I bumped yeah. into it and I was like, let me. I'll just bang it out real quick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you probably get the costumes pretty cheap. I no, I think, oh, yeah, yeah, I think I should try it. Their outfits, and they were yeah. cheap because yeah. it was early. 
Yeah. What was that? Yeah, I think like you know, like at my point, like you know, I have to like finally try it, like because you know, like uh, before, like this only fans, like you know, like pop up, and like everyone become like content creator. Yes. I was just porn actress. Yep. I yeah. was just getting on set, like having mm -hmm. script, and like you know, doing what like you know I've told. Yep. And now I have to create all that shit yes. myself, and yes. I'm like, oh, and like you know, like yeah, I cannot <laughs> say like you know, like I couldn't do this and stuff, but like you know, it's still like you know to get this inspiration to figure it out, and like you yes. know, because sometimes I see like video of some like guys or girls. Like they are like, like you know, open the door and three seconds away, like you know, like they just have final sex, and I'm like, okay, like I want a story, like you know, because yeah. most of yeah. the time, like you know, like I'm getting turned on in the moment, like you know, like before it's happened, like mm -hmm. the moment of like seduction, the moment of yes. teasing. Sorry, uh -huh. yes. You need to be built up. I love yes, that. And this is a point. This is what to do. Like, yeah, mm -hmm. just for now, like since I'm a little bit like push like the porn away, like professional one. Yeah. I yeah. live like you know, I will live like few things like you know, like to keep like, still being on, but like you know, the most of the time, like I gonna do like my. And I'm like, sure, maybe, you know, I have to dress like a Cheshire cat and put some butt plug yes. in. Yes, <laughs> you know. <laughs> because, you know, like, I was thinking actually about, like, Halloween. Like, I wanted to dress up like a She's Cheshire cat, fun. and he has a tail. And I'm like, okay, do I have to, like, tie it, like, you know, to my skirt or, like, just to do the real tail? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, like, you know, like, you know, people are cruel. They can pull the fucking tail. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> I People love are it. cool. I love they it. might pull the tail. Yeah. All right. Yeah. <laughs> we'll take a couple of phone calls, but call in right now, yeah, kids. It's 818-231-2580. That's 818-231-2580. Call in right now and talk to the stars. Um, let's give everybody your social media handles, please. Sure. Start with you, Stella. Okay. Um, on Twitter, I'm, or sorry, X. Uh, Stella Carter XXX, Instagram, the Stella Carter X, um, OnlyFans, many vids, everything else, it's all Stella Carter yeah, XXX, yeah. besides uh, Instagram, which is the Stella Carter X. You're a New Yorker. Right? <laughs> I am. No, I, I am. So. You've got that, that, that style to you. <laughs> Takes right. one to know one, right? right? Yeah. I love you. Love you. <laughs> Tori. Oh, so all of my socials are uh, the Tori Easton, all oh, across okay. the board. Oh. Do you have uh, what the, the, the kids call that link tree thing? I do. I have a link tree website, which is, I think it's just www.toriesten.com, which will bring you to everything. Mm -hmm. And then link tree is the same. It's just link tree at toriesten.com. Uh, new movie scene coming out? I don't know the titles yet. I took mm -hmm. a little bit of a sabbatical. Okay. And so I just this past well, few weeks. thank you for coming on. Why, thank, yeah. you. thank you for having me. Yeah. Um, mm -hmm. And so I just shot my first six scenes from the first time in like six or seven months, and I don't know the titles of them yet, mm -hmm. but they will be announced on Twitter and um, Instagram as well. Very good. Stella, mm -hmm. you got a new scene coming out? I do, yeah. I have a new Jeff's Models anal scene coming out. Oh, very yeah, cool. Yeah, since we're all about the anal. And I here. saw you, you came to my old studio, Planetary, didn't you? And did the yes. scene with J. Crew? Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Uh huh. I'm trying to get that studio back. That Are was, you? It I was loved a it there. It really was. And J. Crew and Jay's Models, they're great. Yeah. Yeah, they're really cool. Now, darling, I know you've been taking a little time off, but do you have anything new on uh, the OnlyFans? Well, uh, you know, like, I maybe like, had a time off, like, from the porn, but porn, like, didn't have time off from me. And just, like, oh. you know, like, today or, like, yesterday, I have, like, the, like, you know, another stepmom, like, you know, like, things. It's called, like, you know, like, uh, your sex toy or, like, something. And, of course, I'm fucking my, like, fucking handsome stepson. Like, you know, like, he's one of my, like, you know, another, like, you know, like, my kind of, like, favorite, like, uh, male, like, talent and stuff. It looks good. Are you cool about doing those scenes? With you know, the like stepson? it's like you know, like when guys looks like a guy's not like a baby. It's like yes, I'm totally fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, yeah. It's, <laughs> because like you know, like I'm still at this age when like you know, like I, I don't have this like you know, like sugar sugar daddy issues. But like I still like it, like you know, like guys who like my age, like you know, like people my age, like like and still like older than me people. Mm -hmm. But like you know, when it's like uh, looks like you know, it's it's really like just like you know, was like pull out from the tears with a milk and milk. <laughs> Like, you know, I, I think, yes, like, you know, yeah. I, think like, you know, I love you. Let me, like, you know, reach this, like, 50 when, like, you know, mm -hmm. I'm like, okay, where is this next Yeah, yeah. yeah. We're a cougar era. Yeah, yeah. so, like, yeah. so now, now, now I'm 
I'm still a baby and things and so on. Like just like yeah, like you can check my Twitter with like underscore rush one eight seven underscore like last like million years. So and there is you can see what like you know there is a new movie. It's like milf.com or like something of milf, but so you will see this, you will find it, mm -hmm. and it's going to be promoted everywhere. Uh, my Instagram as always is Godmother Rush. Like your favorite and only one godmother. Stepmoms, it's a lot of around, but godmother is only one. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very good. Too. And you can follow me at James Bartolet on Twitter at James Bartolet9. Instagram, onlyfans.com slash James Bartolet. Loyalfans.com slash James Bartolet. And I started this new thing that's supposed to be an alternative for Twitter. Oh. And it's called Sky Blue. Edric, was that the name of it? Sky Blue or Blue Sky? I don't remember. Okay. But it's, they're beta testing it now, so it's supposed to be the alternative for Twitter. Here's the benefit for us in XXX. Here's the benefit. They will allow us to put the adult content up there. And I know a lot of people in the adult industry were just throwing up these scenes. Yeah. And the girls, mm -hmm. like, spread their legs so much, it's like... Right. Was that a porn scene, or did you get something from the gynecologist? <laughs> office? Yeah, I don't know what the fuck. Like a hater, but like you know, like come on, like why we have to give up all of our like porn, like sexy content, just like you know, like to be like you know visible or noticed. Like, you know, like, yes, like you work for this heart, True. like you know, like why, like you have to show like your boobs, like you know, like other part of your body for some, like you know, uh, free like social media, like just mm -hmm. like you know, like to uh, lure people to yourself, and like you know, mm -hmm. they already like you know, bunch of like you know, like this, like you know, like the thirsty dogs, like this is enough for them just to see. Yeah. Thirsty dogs. Like, like, that's enough to see like you know boobies and or like you know thirty yeah. seconds of something, and like you yeah. know, like okay, let me be honest, like sometimes like you know, like when like you know, I don't want to go to Pornhub, I just scroll someone like you know, like Twitter, Twitter. who like. Yeah. Lost a lot of shit, and I'm like, oh, I found this two minutes. God yeah. damn, it's good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell you, if sure. Elon Musk, you take porn off of Twitter, you're gonna lose Ooh. probably. No, he, he's still, no, he's still, no, he's still. work for Tumblr. Long. No, oh, he's yeah. still, he's still right. Yeah, the yeah. Porn <laughs> right. Yeah, right. just dropped. Yeah. Because people are going in there. So true. But guys, like, no, let, let's, let's, yeah. like, you know, like, let's uh, acknowledge the things. But like, no, no, people, no. people, no. people no. who yeah. looking for a porn, they know where is to find the porn. Mm. And now, like, you know, like the thing is, like, unfortunately, like, you know, Instagram or Instagram internet, it's like pretty, you know, accessible for everyone. Like, you know, and parents, like, you know, they, like, you know, they will blame you, 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 and me oh, yeah. for their kids, like, yeah. to be able to go, like, to the same yes. theater, like, you know, yeah. and get Not pervert the and stuff. Yep. Yeah. yeah, and so, right. and this is the things like you know from one hand it's kind of like you know put it down but again like people who want to find it they don't find it like come on like we all like mm -hmm. do like when you want to find some shit you will find for example we you know like did. you know uh -huh. i cannot spell i cannot spell your name like properly but like trust me like give me a couple hours yes. i will find you on instagram yes. like i will find you fucking yeah. everywhere like so and people who really like you know want to find it they will find it and so and this is like made of like you know like just for an idea at least like you know what this like you know like you know generation or like you know people who don't see some stuff like they know they don't get it like so easily because like look again like what's happened right now like you know it's again like yeah i'm for diversity i'm like for like you know free will and for everything but like come on like you know like uh, we have to like you know put away something from the people who are not at age on time like to like you know like go in porn yeah, they have to porn. fucking study yeah. that fucking she like she like small shit have to like you know doing homework yeah yeah and like not about like oh like i just go into like you know like twitter like and i see everything mm. and how like you know like this dude or they're girl, like, going to like uh, objectify themselves if mm -hmm. they see what like you know it's easy to fuck and like it's okay to be in slut and stuff like it's okay to be slut for us yeah not for you guys. Yeah. You know, yeah. like this is a difference. So like, uh, and yes, yeah, yeah. like, yes, maybe it's like not so good. But in the moment of like, you know, like, come on, like I'm still, I want the same followers. I want to like normal people. Like, yes, like they can have their kinks. They can have like, you know, like some weird shit. Like and I fucking love it. Like, yes, yes. But like, you know, I don't want laid. to hear from like 15 years yeah. old. Yeah. Like, you know, like I want to do this and that. Like, oh, I you know, slap shit out of your face. Like, you know, it's not right. And so, and in that case, like, you know, like, yes, like maybe like, you no, know, like too much. Uh, too many accessible yes yeah. too much yeah, 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 for sure. I did come from the age of like right when porn became so accessible right and oh honey I accessed it oh like, yeah and it was I so was, you know like I was like I was in yeah. Russia and yeah. I was chasing like for like, DVDs 
Mm -hmm. I find out lesbian exists like when I was 15 and I'm like, fuck, I'm okay. Mm -hmm. Before 15, I was thinking like something wrong with me. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. like so, and it's really like, you know, I, we was exchanging that. Mm -hmm. It was like something like, you know, like this, like, you know, forbidden apple. It was mm -hmm. something, you know, which is super yeah. desirable. Like, you know, like, you like, you look ready, like, yes. okay, like you want this, like I give you this dress, give me fucking like yeah. DVD and stuff. And now I'm like, okay, like I see your tits, I see your pussy, mm -hmm. like I even know how you suck. Like, you know, go and fuck your tits. <laughs> yeah. yeah, and so, and like so, and that, you know, at least like, you know, so that will help to uh, make us like, you know, desirable and like try to like reach mm -hmm. us more and mm -hmm. not have us like, you know, like just open. Oh, it's you. Like, so it that's still sound. Yes. Like yes. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's a fucking sorry. treasure and you have to dig for a treasure. Like, come on. True. Yeah. All right, we got to wrap. I got, we're really getting into a group here. <laughs> I know, yeah. I love it. This is great. Um, but we got to cut it short here tonight. Uh, we want to thank Crystal Rush for being here tonight. All this for sure. Corey Easton. Stella. 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 Thank you. Yes. <laughs> All right, and I'm James Bartolet. Till next time, I'm James Bartolet. I'm Crystal Rush. Tori Easton. Stella Carter. Good night and good sex. Oh. <laughs>